In the world of art and design, few tools are as fundamental and versatile as the color wheel. It serves as a guide for artists, designers, and anyone working with color. The origins of this powerful tool can be traced back to the 17th century with Sir Isaac Newton's groundbreaking experiments with light and prisms. His work revolutionized our understanding of color. Newton demonstrated that white light is a composite of all visible colors, a discovery that was both astonishing and enlightening for the scientific community. By passing sunlight through a prism, he separated it into a spectrum of colors, much like a rainbow, revealing the hidden complexity of light. Newton's work laid the foundation for the development of the color wheel, organizing the spectrum into a circular diagram. This diagram not only shows the relationships between colors, but also helps in understanding color harmony and contrast, essential concepts in art and design. The traditional color wheel is based on primary, secondary, and tertiary colors. The three primary colors are red, yellow, and blue, which cannot be created by mixing other colors. Secondary colors are created by mixing two primary colors. Red and yellow make orange, yellow and blue make green, and blue and red make violet. Tertiary colors are made by mixing a primary color with an adjacent secondary color, like red-orange or blue-violet. This framework helps organize the vast spectrum of colors and their relationships. Colors are categorized as warm or cool based on their perceived temperature and psychological associations. This classification helps us understand how different colors can affect our emotions and perceptions. Warm colors like red, orange, and yellow evoke warmth, energy, and passion, making objects appear closer. These colors are often associated with sunlight, fire, and heat, which can stimulate and energize the viewer. Cool colors like blue, green, and violet evoke calmness and tranquility, making objects appear farther away. These hues are reminiscent of water, sky, and foliage, promoting relaxation and peace. The temperature of a hue can be influenced by surrounding colors. This interaction can change how we perceive the warmth or coolness of a particular color. For example, yellow-green can appear warmer next to reds, enhancing its vibrancy and intensity, and cooler next to blues, which can make it seem more subdued and calming. Understanding color temperature is essential for creating balanced compositions. Artists and designers use this knowledge to evoke specific feelings and direct the viewer's attention. This distinction influences the mood and atmosphere conveyed by a color palette, allowing for a more intentional and impactful visual experience. The color wheel is an essential tool that guides the creation of harmonious color combinations, known as color schemes. It helps in visualizing how different colors interact with each other. Monochromatic schemes use different values of a single hue, creating a sense of unity and sophistication. This approach is often used to create a cohesive and elegant look. Analogous schemes use adjacent colors on the wheel, evoking harmony and tranquility. These schemes are often found in nature and are pleasing to the eye. Complementary schemes use opposite colors on the wheel, creating maximum contrast and visual impact. This high contrast can make elements stand out and grab attention. Split complementary schemes use a base color and two colors adjacent to its complement, offering a balanced yet less intense contrast. This scheme is versatile and easier to work with. Triadic schemes use three evenly spaced colors, like the primary triad of red, yellow, and blue. This creates a vibrant and balanced palette that is visually appealing. Tetradic schemes use two complementary pairs, requiring careful balance to avoid overwhelming the viewer. This scheme offers a rich variety of color combinations. Understanding these relationships empowers artists and designers to make informed color choices, enhancing their work's visual appeal and effectiveness. Mastery of color schemes is crucial for creating compelling designs. The principles of the color wheel apply across various disciplines, from interior design to marketing. In interior design, warm colors create cozy atmospheres, while cool colors evoke tranquility. Fashion designers use the color wheel to create harmonious outfits and bold statements. Marketing campaigns leverage color psychology to influence consumer behavior. Red is used in fast food logos for hunger and excitement, while green promotes eco-friendly products. Web designers use the color wheel to enhance readability and evoke emotional responses. Understanding color theory ensures aesthetically pleasing and effective designs. 
Digital technology has revolutionized color interaction, providing unprecedented control and precision. Tools like Adobe Color and Coolers make exploring color relationships and creating custom palettes easier. Adobe Color allows users to generate schemes based on rules like analogous or complementary. Digital tools expand the capabilities of the color wheel with features like real-time harmonies and color adjustment sliders. As technology evolves, more innovative tools will enhance our understanding of color theory. Despite advancements, the fundamental principles of the color wheel remain timeless and relevant. As we look into the future, it's essential to remember that color is not just a visual experience, but an emotional one. Colors can evoke feelings, influence perceptions, and even alter decisions. From the calming blues of a serene ocean to the passionate reds of a blooming rose, each hue carries its own story and impact. In the world of marketing, brands harness the power of color to connect with their audience on a deeper level. Think about the vibrant reds of Coca-Cola, evoking excitement and energy, or the calming greens of Starbucks, suggesting relaxation and comfort. These choices are not accidental but are deeply rooted in color psychology. Moreover, color plays a vital role in storytelling across different media. Filmmakers use color grading to set the mood of a scene, from the warm, nostalgic tones of a sunset to the cold, desaturated hues of a dystopian future. Similarly, in video games, designers employ color to guide players, create atmosphere, and enhance the immersive experience. As we continue to innovate and evolve, the emotional impact of color will remain a cornerstone of human expression and connection. Whether through a digital screen, a printed page, or a physical space, color will always find a way to touch our hearts and minds. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the world of color theory. We hope this exploration has inspired you to see and use color in new, meaningful ways. Copyright 2024, Sozo Publishing, LLC.